Hi guys, Mike back here today at Valenti Maserati in Hartford, Connecticut. Today, I have another special, special review for you guys. And before I get into that review, I just wanna let you guys know on May 27th, I'm having another iPhone 11 Pro Max giveaway, guys, and a $1,000 giveaway. So whoever wins first gets to choose between one of those two things. And then the second winner will get whatever the first winner didn't choose so in order to win all you guys have to do is hit that like button on the left and then hit the subscribe button on the right and that's it guys and again it's totally free to subscribe all you guys have to do is hit that like button on the left and then hit the subscribe button on the right and you guys are entered in to win a brand new iphone 11 pro max or a thousand dollars guys and i'm pretty sure anybody can use either one of those so guys but back into the review now today I'm doing another special review on the all new 2020 Maserati Ghibli or Ghibli. Um, I'm really sorry. Uh, I might, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, but uh, it's the Grand Sport Maserati Ghibli. And again, guys, this is a beautiful, beautiful car. It's absolutely stunning absolutely gorgeous gorgeous car guys look how beautiful this car is it's absolutely stunning you got your nice little air intake right here which is really good for the engine you got the grand sport badge right there and guys just take a quick look of how this car just looks like it's absolutely beyond amazing you got the nice little maserati badge right there you got the sq4 badge right there and then you got the nice maserati and the chrome which is a really really nice touch with the ghibli badge right there i i hope i'm saying that correctly guys and if i'm not i'm sorry I just feel stupid when it comes to these names because I'm not sure like how to pronounce them. Uh, but you got your nice backup camera right here. You got your parking sensors right here. You got them also in the front as well. And then you got your nice dual chrome exhaust tips. Glossed black exhaust tips, which are really, really sick for this car, guys. Look how insane that that looks. Just look how amazing this is, guys. I, I, I'm sorry, I just can't get over the fact of how beautiful this car is. And you got your nice air intake right here as well for the engine. Now, this is the 2020 Ghibli Q4 Grand Sport. And it has 424 horsepower twin turbo V6, guys. And let me show you guys the interior like the interior is my favorite favorite part about this car guys and it is absolutely insane look at the carbon fiber and then you got your power locks your power doors your power windows you got the black leather with the red leather look how nice we made that this car was built like it's insane you got some more storage space down here you got the Harman Kardon sound system throughout the entire car which is a really really expensive audio system which is like i said a really expensive sound system especially for a car which is a really really cool feature you got the nice maserati badge right here you got 10-way power adjustable driver side seats and passenger side seats just look at this interior guys okay this is like high-end stuff right here like this is high end right here guys look at this nice suede all throughout the entire car you got the nice red on black dashboard like look how insane this stuff is you got the nice glove box right here i don't know what the hell that is but sorry guys and then you got some space up there you got more sort of space right down there which is really cool I didn't even know that they did this 
but that's pretty cool. I guess they do that so everything stays safe, which is pretty cool. And then you got, look at that infotainment screen. And then look at all this carbon fiber, all in the center console. Like that is insane. If you guys are in the market for a car, this is definitely one for you guys to check out first, guys. Like I swear to God, like I am a truck guy all the way. But I honestly, I swear to God, I'm about to trade in my truck and get this car. Like, this is it. crazy. You got your nice carbon fiber right here throughout the door, just like the other doors. You got your power locks, your power windows, your power doors, everything. You got your black on the red, which is really, really nice. You got the Harman Kardon speaker sound system right there. You got your Maserati badge right there, which is really, really nice. Right here, you got your nice little divider. You got, you got your cup holders right here. And then right here, you got some more storage space down there, which is really, really nice. I love this touch. They did this really, really nicely. Right there, you got your heated seat buttons and your ventilated seat buttons. And then you got your vent controls right there for your heat and your AC, which is really, really cool. Just look at the way that they did this car. Like, it's absolutely crazy. Like, this right here is when you know that you're doing good in life. So, yeah. Like, this is when you know, like, you're at that top level in life. And when you made it. Because this right here is a very, very expensive car. And I'm pretty sure I don't have to tell many people how expensive this car is. Um, because I think it speaks for itself got the nice Maserati red calibers right there on the whip on the rims sorry I don't know why I can't really speak today and you got the nice Pirelli sports tires like and then you got the nice 20 inch rims which goes absolutely all in all with this car just take another quick 10 second look at this beautiful beautiful machine and then to get into the back press this button twice and then your back door will go open nice and smooth like look how awesome that was and you got your nice charging port right there and then you got your spare tire and everything down there which is really really cool and they definitely have really good amount of space for a sports car like this is a very very beautiful car they did this car very very nice I love that Maserati badge in the back and then the carbon fiber continues now for you guys that don't know what carbon fiber is it's a very expensive material and it's a very very beautiful material as you guys can already see so them putting something like that inside of this it it just had to go together because they're two very very expensive things and who wouldn't want a maserati with a lot of carbon fiber it's just absolutely amazing that the way they did this car you got your power locks your power doors more Harman Kardon speakers you got your Maserati badge right there on your back seats which is really nice and you got your lights right there for the back seat which is pretty cool and then um, quickly I'm going to show you guys how to get into the engine which is right there Show you all of the horsepower show you how to get in well, if I can get in myself all oh, right there and you got that nice v6 engine the twin turbo look at how monstrous this engine is guys okay just take a quick second 
take a quick minute and look at how beefy this engine is. This is like one of the nicest cars that I've ever, ever done a review for and I can't even believe that I'm still doing the review here for it. I love this car, it's absolutely nuts. Now to let you guys know what else it has to offer. Again, it has the 424 horsepower twin turbo V6 engine. It's got Skyhook adaptive damping suspension, performance brakes and sport inspired exterior and interior. And it's all wheel drive guys. So this car right here can go through any kind of snow, mud, anything guys. So it's all wheel drive. If you live in a place like New England, like I do, this is a great car. I mean, if you ever had to go in the snow, trust me, this this ride right here would be a very, very fun ride taking the snow. And also, it has limited slip differential. It has skyhook suspension with electronic damping control. It's got the Q4 intelligent all-wheel drive. It's got the eight-speed automatic transmission. It's got sport mode, integrated vehicle control, electric, electric power steering, speed sensitive power assisted steering. It's got ice mode, sport mode. It's got engine stop start feature. It's got the 20 inch polished Utrano wheels with the all season Pirelli tires with the nice red caliper Maserati. Like how beautiful is this guys? Then it's also got a 3.0 twin turbo V6 engine. I'm pretty sure I already mentioned that to you guys. And it's got 424 horsepower and 428 foot feet of torque. So that's a lot of power for this car, guys. So if you guys like to go fast, this is a car that you guys want to check out. And it also has a power sunroof. It has the high gloss piano black wood trim extended leather upholstery with accent stitching as 12-way power sport front seats with driver memory functions it's got a seven inch driver infotainment display it's got inox sport pedals it's got aluminum column mounted paddle shifters it's got soft closed doors auto dimming door and rear view mirrors front laminated glass it's got home link garage door opener, dual zone automatic climate control with air quality sensor. It's got the keyless entry and remote start system. It's got an 8.4 inch Maserati touch control plus with navigation, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. It's got active blind spot assist with lane keeping assist, surround view camera, front and rear parking sensors. It's got forward collision warning plus, pedestrian recognition and traffic sign recognition. Adaptive cruise control with stop and go. It's got highway assist, adaptive full LED headlamps, full LED tail lamps. It's got an alarm system with an electronic parking brake, tire pressure monitoring system. It's got the Maserati stability program. And it's got automatic hill hold with brake assistance system. So guys, this right here is a must, must see. If you guys are in the market for a fast car, a fast, fast sports car, this is an absolute must-see, guys. Again, this is the 2020 Ghibli SQ4 Grand Sport Maserati. And it is absolutely stunning. Look at those LED headlamps with the Maserati badge right in it. I just love that front end. I love the whole Maserati badge. Like, no other badge like no other automaker makes a badge like that like it's insane or a front grill i should say sorry guys don't 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 kill me i'm sorry guys i meant uh front grill and then you got the nice carbon fiber all throughout the driver side door as well you got your power locks your power windows your power side mirrors which i'll get into in a minute you got more harman Kardon speakers you got some more storage space right here you got 12 way power adjustable driver and passenger side seating 12 way not 10 way not 8 way not 6 way not 4 way 
but 12 way i'm pretty sure most automakers don't make a 12 way power adjustable driver passenger side seat so that by itself is pretty sick so right here you got memory seats so number one is driver number two is passenger so what that does is you program the seat the way you want it as far as front as far back as far high as far low whatever way you want to do it and then in this case because you'd be the driver you would hold the number one button down after you program the seat the way you want it and then every day when you go start your car back up it'll go back right to the spot that it was originally programmed or until you change it again down the road which is a really really cool feature i have it in my truck and it's a very good feature to have because every day when i get in my truck and start it up it goes exactly back to the first day when i programmed it because i liked it the way that it is so the way i set it up is the way i love it so that way i don't ever have to change it which i guess if I ever really want to, I can change it anytime I want. But I like the way it I am positioned inside of my truck. So that's the exact same thing here. So and same goes for the passenger. So the passenger you would just hold the number two button after you program that one. Which is pretty cool. <clears throat> Alright guys, now I'm gonna show you guys how everything works in here. You got your brake and your gas sport pedals which is really really cool and right here you got a little bit more storage space down there which is really really cool now you hold the brake pedal and then you push the button to start and your Maserati sorry guys hold on one second I gotta turn down the I gotta turn it down Sorry, it took me a second to figure out where to turn the volume down, which is you could turn it down right here and just twist it back and then the volume goes down. But yeah, um, <laughs> these these cars have so much going on, it's insane. Um, so it takes a quick second to figure out where everything is. But uh, right here is your power adjustable driver and passenger side mirrors, which is really, really cool. So they both go in which is really, really awesome. Uh, you got heated outside mirrors as well. So if you live in a place like New England, like I do, and snow gets on your mirrors, well, snow's not gonna get on your mirrors, well, at least when you're driving, because it's gonna melt all of that snow right off. So no snow will ever accumulate unless, of course, your car is sitting and not on and snow is piling up, then that's gonna do that. But once you start driving and everything, no snow will ever pile up because you got heated outside mirrors. And you got the blind spot cross path detection. You got that right there. Um, I'll show you guys real quick. That little, little triangle right here. What that does is it's the blind spot and cross path detection. So when you're, say like you're on a highway for a perfect example, Say when you're on the highway and you want to go left and you want to get into the left lane and somebody's coming up behind you. Well, it's going to make a really loud noise inside the car and it's going to alert right there. That little triangle is going to light up and then also right here is going to light up and let you know that somebody's in your blind spot. So that way you don't get into an accident, which is really a really cool, cool feature. And then you got sport performance shifter paddles which is really cool i love this whole sport performance entire vehicle i love it so much and uh, then right here you got your heated steering wheel uh then you got your controls right here for everything in there so right here you would do that you go to driver mode your vehicle info tire pressure your, you can see your electric miles per hour reader you got your vehicle settings, you got your stored messages, your audio controls, your stop and start feature, trip A, trip B, all that great stuff. All those settings are right there, which is really nice. And you got a nice little mirror right here, which is pretty cool. And then right here, you got a manual open sunroof, but just for that part, that's for the sunscreen. And then you press this button right here. And then that would open up the window. 
Oops, sorry. There we go. And then you got a nice sunroof in your sports car. I love this car. Like, it's absolutely insane. Like, this car is nuts. It really is. And you can control that as well. As, hot, as high as that goes, as far as that goes. So that's pretty cool. And then you just manually close it again. And then you're good to go. And then right here is your trunk button. So you can press that open. Your trunk will go pop open, which is pretty cool. You got your parking sensor button right here, which you can turn on and off. I don't think you should ever do that because for one simple fact that it's going to keep you from getting into accidents. And I guess some people don't like it, some people do, I don't know, but I will never turn them off because it has saved me from getting into a bunch of accidents and it's a really good feature. Right here you got universal garage door opener. So if you have an electric garage door opener, you can program this into the electric garage door opener you have at your house or say if you don't have one right now and you get one in like a year or two or down the road in your next house you could program it at that house as well or if you have one at your house now and if you move down the road you could program it into any house that you go which is pretty cool right here is your button for your electric door or i'm not your wow today's been a very long day i'm sorry guys your electric dimmer for your rear view mirror so that means like if somebody is in your blind spot um like so not your blind spot but uh if they have their high beams on and they're flashing them in your rear view and you're blinded you just press that button and your dimmer will come on and it will dim those lights so that way they're not beaming in your eyes to where you can get into an accident so that is a really really cool feature as well and then you got right here your infotainment screen which i want to show you guys real quick i love this whole setup right here with the, like the nice little clock and everything i think that's a really really cool feature i don't know why i'm just i'm a really weird person i just like stuff like that but anyway so you got your radio controls right here it's got sirius xm you got your media controls you got your controls right here for your active blind spot assist lane keep assist forward collision warning traffic sign assist uh auto high beam assist like you got so many different settings right here it's insane your surround camera so you got surround view camera like this is your car so if you're backing up and say like there's a car right here and a truck right here and you need to see exactly where you're going you literally will see your car moving at the same time as you are and this is a 360 view it's insane and then right here is your backup camera you got your front view camera right here and then you got your 360 view camera and then you got your 360 view camera in the back as well how awesome is that like this car has so many different features that it's absolutely insane insane it's got the navigation right here which is really really cool uh, you got your climate controls right here for your heated and ventilated seats, your heated steering wheel, your passenger heated and ventilated seats. And you got your phone settings right here so you can set up your iPhone, your Android phone, whatever you're trying to set up. You got a rear sunshade button. Look how sick that is. Look how insane that was, guys. Look at that. You got a rear sunshade button. So you press that button. And then your sunshade goes back down and then watch it go back up look how sick that was isn't that sick i i've never seen that on any kind of car i think that is like the coolest feature i've ever seen and i'm really i'm really excited by little things like so that is that's that's so crazy oh my god that's so nuts and then you got your user guide right here you got your radio controls your controls right here your app manager controls right there so this right here has so many different kind of things going on it's absolutely nuts no wonder why these cars are so expensive like oh my god if i ever win the lotto i'm telling you right now i'm buying this car straight from the factory oh my god i love it then you got your dual climate control controls right here for your heat, your AC. Um, so what that means is if you want to be cold on your driver's side, they want to be hot on their passenger side or vice versa. You want to be hot, they want to be cold. You can do that. That's the great thing about dual climate control. 
And then look at this, guys. This is all carbon fiber. This is all carbon fiber, like carbon fiber, carbon fiber, carbon fiber. It's so crazy. Like, it's insane. This is a very, very expensive, expensive material. And they just did an absolute amazing job with this entire car. It's in the doors. It's right here. It's so crazy. It's so nice. And then right here, press this little button and you got some nice little storage space down there you can put your wallet you can put your phone you got your usb ports right here for your iphone android whatever you want to charge so this thing's like hidden which is pretty cool and then right here you got your traction control button you got your stop and go feature you got your ice control mode you got your sport mode which is really cool and this is your shifter like look how sick this is isn't that crazy you got your maserati badge right here Right here, you got your button to hold down when you want to go into a different shifter mode. So then you're in drive right now. And then say you want to go into reverse. You go into reverse. And then bam. And then your backup camera, your 360 camera, all your camera views pop open, which is pretty cool. And then you just hold this button down again if you want to go back into drive or neutral. And, and same goes for every other drive. And then if you want to go into park, just press that button. And then it goes right back into park. And then it will pop up right there on the bottom and it'll tell you exactly what what gear you're in which is pretty cool as well and then right here is your electric park brake so you just flip it up like that and then your little brake sign will turn on which is pretty cool and then your brake park engage would go on too as well which is pretty cool and then right here are your settings right here turn up your volume for your radio and then you can use the the top ones for your radios so uh, your tune or uh, your volume control and then this right here controls all of those so you can do that throughout your entire thing which is pretty cool and then go to a setting you just press that button down and then it will go like that so you can do it just like that so you just hit that button down and then bam you're good to go and then look at that nice rebel logo it says one of a hundred so this was the first one so they made a hundred of these guys how insane is that and this is number one so this one just came out how crazy is that and then you got your nice like cup holders right here which is pretty cool then right here you press that button and you got some more storage space down there which is really really nice and then right here to get into your center console which i love bam just like that I'm not really sure why there's cup holders down there. I'm not sure if those are cup holders. I'm, I'm not really sure, but it's really weird why there would be cup holders in there. But I mean, you got some more cup holders right there, which is pretty cool. And then right here, you got your little on and off switch for your stuff over there. And then you got your charge port right here, which is pretty cool. I just love center consoles and look at this setup. Bam, bam, press that button. They just slide both open like that. How awesome is that? Pretty sick, right? But yeah, uh, real quick, I want to show you guys the electric car starter before I end the video. So to start your electric car starter, you might make sure it's locked and then you hit this button twice. Um, I think the battery is dead on this one too. Hold on, guys. Oh, the, the hood wasn't closed all the way. There we go. You hear that nice twin turbo V6 engine start up? You hear how quiet that was, right? Mad quiet. And you hit that button twice again, and then it turns off. So if you live in a place like New England, like I do, this is a really, really good feature to have because for the cool, simple fact that 
it will start up your heated steering wheel. It'll start up your heat and your heated seats in the winter time because it can feel how cold it is outside. So that's a really, really cool feature, right? And then you got all your nice um, sensors in the front as well. Like I mentioned to you guys in the back that we already went over it. And you got your front view camera right there with a nice Maserati badge right there. I love this car. This car is absolutely crazy. Yeah, but again, guys, this like this car is just absolutely amazing. And look at the key fob. The key fob is pretty sick as well. And guys, again, May 27th, I'm having another iPhone 11 Pro Max giveaway, guys, and a thousand dollar giveaway. So all you guys have to do to win is hit that like button on the left, and then hit the subscribe button right there on the right, and you guys will be entered in to win a brand new iPhone 11 Pro Max and a thousand dollars. Well, you can win one or the other. So the first winner can choose between either or. So that will be up to the first winner. And then the second winner will get the prize that the first winner didn't choose. So if he chose the iPhone 11 Pro Max, then the second winner would get the $1,000. If he chose the $1,000, then the second winner would get the iPhone 11 Pro Max. So it really all depends on who subscribes and likes and gets to it first so um that's up to you guys so but again guys it's totally free to subscribe all you guys got to do is hit that like button on the left and hit the subscribe button on the right and you guys will be entered in to win a brand new iphone 11 pro max guys but uh yeah guys again thank you so much for watching my videos i'm very grateful and thankful for all my viewers all my subscribers thank you guys so much i couldn't do any of this without you guys i hope you guys are all staying safe and again guys this is the 2020 maserati all-wheel drive ghibli grand sport s q4 guys and i'm gonna do a quick walk around one more time so you guys can see it again full length this car is absolutely one of the prettiest cars that i've ever seen in my life and ever been able to do a review on guys and again, like I said, guys, I couldn't do this without you guys. And I want to just say thank you. And I appreciate you guys all so much. And again, guys, thank you so much. And I hope you guys are all staying safe. And I hope you guys are starting to really like my videos, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. And stay tuned for the next one, guys. Stay safe out there.